Hi everybody, this is a video of the 250 watt self ballasted mercury vapor light bulb. As you can see, it says on here 250 watt, yep, that's right. And on here it says high pressure mercury lamp, be lighted with ballast, fluorescent coated, can replace normal lamp for energy saving. Yep, that's right, and it has 250 watts. And this is the bulb I ordered off eBay and it came to my flat tonight. Yep, that's right. So, <clears throat> and on here it says HPM stands for high pressure mercury. Yep, that's right. And on here it says 220 volts and uh, 250 watts. E40, that stands for Edison 40. Yep, that's right. And as uh, you can see now, I'm going to get it out of its box and you'll see in one second or two, everybody. So, so I'm going to take this little thing off. So, I'm going to... Put the carton on the on the box on the breakfast tea table. I meant to say so. Anyway, so here I have the the 250 watt self ballasted mercury vapor light bulb, and as you can see, it's a very tall one, and it's got the big screw cap. It's Edison 40, and it and it doesn't really have the name of the company on it. And on here it says has the name of the company on the bulb itself, and it says um, what does it say? It says um. BHM, I don't know, it's a bit squiggled. It says 250 watts, E40, Edison 40, that's what I meant to say. Um, self ballast and uh, 220 to 240 volts and uh, SW Clark LTD, it stands for limited. And it says, uh, what does it say on it? It says, uh, I can't read what it says, the words are a bit too small. But anyway, it says, um, quality lighting and lamps yep that's right so anyway i'm going to uh put it into the socket now so all right it's taking its time to go down now but it's fitting down now it's getting fitted in like so yep that's it it's fitted down now it's in a ceramic lamp holder now so it's fitted in like so so it's ready to fire up in one second or two, everybody. So I'm going to turn off this lamp now. So, right, that's it now. The, the lamp's gone out. So onto the self-ballasted mercury vapor bulb, everybody. Ready? After three. One, two, three. Wow, it's very bright. Yeah, as you can see, it's 250 watts bright. And it's, uh, it's quite bright. And it's like a normal incandescent light bulb. Yep, that's right. And it will start with the uh, incandescent filament and then it will soon change to mercury. Yep, that's right. Let's take a good look into the bulb now. Can you see? It's like the filament is right near to the bottom of the bulb. Yeah. And as you and it is, and it is really bright. And um as I thought the other one like the other 160 watt self ballasted mercury bulbs got in that carton like that. Yep, that's right. So as you can see now it's Come on, full brightness. As you look all around my room, it's lit really, really bright. And as you see, and uh, that picture of Triple H, and um, as you look down now, is it it's still it incandescent, isn't it? Yeah. Let's have a look at it that this way. So, oh, you can see the filament. Yeah, it's right on the side. It's right. It looks like it's on the bottom of the bulb. Yeah. And um, it is. Um, it's like Venus, like a jacket potato. I think the filament's more, yeah, the filament is more a C shape. Yeah, and it's, um, and it's like a semi-octagon shape. Yeah, as you can see now, it's, a, it's at, um, still a incandescent, but it looks like it's starting to change to mercury. It might be doing, but anyway, as you can see now, the, the bulb's fully lit up. I suppose you, you don't have to, wait for it to brighten up because it comes on like a normal incandescent yep that's right and as you can see now is it is it looks like it's starting to change to mercury yeah <laughs> so does it have it say anything in in the carton is there anything else in that's in the carton no there isn't so and uh, all there is is just the just the the box now and it's you know i've already read that but anyway so as you can see now, it looks like it's changing to pure white now, but yeah, 
changing to white. Let's take another good look into it now. So is it getting any bright? Is, is, it, is it changing to mercury? Can't really see because it's it's fully, fully coated in. Yeah, you can't really very well see the incandescent filament for somehow. Yeah, no. Yeah. But anyway, I'm going to take a look on, over into the bulb now. Can you see? Oh, yeah. You can still see the incandescent filament. It looks like a lightning bolt, it does. Yeah. Oh, God, I could, ooh, I could feel the heat from the bulb. Mind you, because that one has 250 watts, so it does get really hotter. Yeah. So, as you can see now, um, it looks like it's changing like a minty glow colour. Yeah. It looks like now it has changed to um, mercury now. So, that means it's fully reached its full brightness. Yeah, it looks really big. When I look at it, it looks like one of those uh, mercury bulbs in a floodlight, especially with that ceramic lamp holder. And that's an Edison 40 lamp holder. Yeah, that's right. So, as you can see, it's um, it's still at um, it's still uh, it's getting a lot brighter. So, as you can see now, it's uh, it's changed to mercury. Let's take another good glimpse into it. Again, yep, it's like a minty colour, uh, it's a minty glow. So, let's take a good look over above now. As you can see, it's chain, It's changing in like a minty glow. Yeah, oh yeah, I can smell the heat. Feel the heat from the bulb. But can you see the filament down under? If I put it down under, can you see? No, you can't really, can't get right under it. So... Well, anyway, I'm going to turn off this bulb and turn it off again, turn it on again, so show you what happens. Right, that's it now. It's gone out now, so it's a total blackout. So I'm going to turn it back on now. Here we go. Right, that's it now. The bulbs are, the bulb's gone out, so I've turned it back on, but it's not come back on straight away just yet. It's, um, it's a total blackout. So I'll see how long it takes for this one to re-strike up. All right, everybody. So please wait. If I be quiet now, I could hear the clock ticking. But we're gonna uh, see um, see how long this one stops off for. But do wait. Might do something any minute now. It might strike up uh, in a minute or two, but but I just have to just wait. Here we go. Wow. That just that just shot straight on straight away. So anyway, so it's back at incandescent now, but a bit of blue gas just flared up. So anyway, I'm gonna take another good glimpse into the bulb now with my tablet. As you can see now it's it's at incandescent. Yeah. So so they both have about uh 250 watts each, so that makes 500. Anyway, I wanna take a look over above now, Let's take a look, good look into the bulb. Yep, as you can see now, the filaments just uh, come back on. It always starts with the incandescent filament before the before the mercury arc tube does. So anyway, I'm going to sit back down. So, and um, as you can see now, it's um, it's, it is really bright. And as you can see, it's just uh, lit back on. So, as you can see now. You can see everything really well. Let's have a look all around my room. Is it look shining really white and all around my room and everything? So, uh, as you can see, it's lighting my room really bright. 
it's still shining very incandescent all around and uh, is it still looking very you see the incandescent film you can't can you no no because the bulbs way too bright but as you can see you can't very well see the filament because the because the because the white coating's too frosted this one's a bit more whiter than that 160 watt one that's had the same carton as this one so it's all same family so and this one's the the middle sister so anyway as you can see now it looks like it's getting ready to start to change to mercury now so as you can see and I was that that's great that, that I've glued it down with a white tack so so uh, the the lamp holder can't move now so it saves me having to hold it tightly so when I'm holding my tablet and as you can see now it's still shining really white yeah so and as you can see it looks like oh looks like it's starting to change to mercury it's like a another good look into it now so oh yep yeah, looks like it is now because it's changing like a minty green color let's uh take a look over above now um can you see anything oh yeah all you can see is just the filament yeah, the filament that's just, you can see, the, the mercury art tube. But as you can see now, it is changing. It's definitely changing to mercury now. So, um, it's, uh, it's shining more whiter, purely and simply white on camera. But as you, as you look all around, it's, it has, it is lit my room really bright. So, as you can see now, it looks like it's uh, changing into a, uh, mercury yeah mercury vapor it's funny when i when i bought the 160 watt one out of the out of the family one like this i always said i did say that i didn't think incandescent and mercury mixed together but it's a good thing though at least that, that means you can connect to direct main supplies like it says on its box so that's what you can see now so anyway as you can see now is it changed fully changed to mercury yeah so it's um looking purely and simply white. Uh let's um I'll take another good glimpse into it. Is it Yep, it is now, it's fully changed to mercury. So I'm going to um look over above now. Oh god, it does feel very hot. But I can smell the heat. But as you can see now, it looks like the mercury art tube's fully flared up now. It's uh, it's at full brightness. Yeah, it has, it's reached its full brightness. So, <coughs> so anyway, it's lit my breakfast tea table so well. It looks better now it's down on to my table, the lamp, than being up in the air. It looks a bit better that way. So I had to use lots of tape so to, to hold the to hold the, the wire down so tightly and keep it to keep it neat and tidy. Just keep it supported. So it keeps me from getting electric shock. So Anyway, anyway, it's reached its full brightness at 250 watts bright, so so it has reached its bright its brightness. So anyway, I'm going to uh, turn off this uh, bulb now. Right, that's it now. The 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 bet the table side lamps coming back on. Right, that's it now. The normal lights just back on now. So so this is the video of the 250 watt self ballasted mercury vapor light bulb everybody so i hope you all enjoyed this video so please comment rate and subscribe thank you for watching everybody